Finally tonight here, so many American dignitaries made the same trip to hear the music, to see the art. Jackie Kennedy among them, until a dictator silenced an entire country. Tonight, the brave group bringing the music back. Mrs. Jacqueline Kennedy takes Pakistan by storm. 1962 and Jackie Kennedy waving to the crowds gathered along the streets of Pakistan. Flowers tossed into her motorcade. The banner at the time long lived the American friendship. And to build it, the State Department sending American jazz greats Duke Ellington, Dizzy Gillespie, and Dave Brubeck on his famous Take Five. But it was Pakistani music Americans went to hear until it was silenced. This address to the nation from a ruthless dictator, General Zia. When he says that he's doing it for the love of the people, but really he's saying that he had to apply a squeeze. I'm trying to close the hand gradually to apply the squeeze where it is necessary. He almost has a smile as he speaks of tightening his grip. It's an evil grin. Films banned the quiet death of Pakistani arts, artists beaten in the streets. But years later, behind closed doors, soundproof walls, Musicians determined to bring the music back, inspired by the American artist who came to visit. Just listen to their own version of Take Five. And now thousands of miles away down this hallway in New York City, you can hear the music rehearsing right there in the room. I can imagine life without food, but not without music. The documentary Song of Lahore following them to America invited you to perform at New York's famed Lincoln Center. The fact that this group is here and that they have an audience here in America, are you proud of that? Very proud. The most unlikely orchestra bringing the music back. And what a treat to have them here in America. The music is back tonight. Thank you for watching on a Tuesday. I'll see you right back here tomorrow night. Good night.